Eat your heart out, White House on the Hill. I don't let my chickens out. My chickens let me out. Good morning from Bobblehead Homestead. This is Jeff. It is beautiful, bright, sunny, t-shirt wearing weather. Uh, probably high 60s. And it's, you know, not even the, it might even hit 70 degrees today. Just a wonderful day here. And so, because it's nice outside, I've got about a thousand things I could be doing. So, I'm just going to get started with emptying my truck. This project will be emptying the bed of my truck. Chicken wire, garden hose, tubs have to go. Chicken wire moved over by the future chicken coop where it will be used. Check. Garden hoses were put in the utility sink, uh, garden sink at the future site of hopefully an outdoor uh, outdoor utility sink but for now the hoses I can run them through the kitchen window and the indoor utility sink is right below that and so the so I can run the hoses out through that window but hoses are out of the truck out of the way and at least in the vicinity of where they will be used. The plastic tubs have been moved over here to my pile of dishes and glassware and stuff that might be garage sale worthy. I will, I'll use those tubs for, well, the, uh, all kinds of stuff. Anyway, they're out of the truck. They're in the place where they might be used next and out of the way. The buckets, the buckets I'm just leaving out, hanging out here, I carry those around the yard so uh, when I'm picking up, you know, debris uh, from around the yard, I can throw it in there. And then I take those over, out to the dumpster. Which reminds me, when I was in Russellville the other day, this was in the road and I had to, uh, you know, drive around it to miss it. So I just stopped, went out and picked it up because it looked like an egg basket and it sure enough is. And that's not metal, it is a pretty durable plastic though, but yeah, I got a free egg basket lying in the road. Yesterday I was talking about uh, trying to pay back the favors for my neighbor. Well, I thought of something today. This is our little lane, and those are puddles of, well, you know, they're potholes. So, um, I'm going to try filling a couple of them in today. This is the little lane that goes to my driveway. That, uh, that's the main Pea Ridge Road right there where the mailboxes are. And then this is the lane that goes to my place and other place, and then the cool neighbor with the cows. And that's my rock wall, and... There's my property right there. So, I am going to go grab some materials <laughs> and try to fix the pothole. Not even close. That's gonna take more than I thought. Oh well, here we go. Okay, the mail carrier was coming down the road and I didn't wanna get busted stealing gravel from the side of the road, so I'm gonna go check my mail. <laughs> Which is right over here. Eh. Junk mail. But yeah, and that 
That is the Wachita National Forest. So, no houses. There's one off to the left of me, but there are none on the right hand side of this road for like, for a ways. And that's all the Wachita National Forest. <sighs> okay, on to whatever comes next. Down, thousand to go.